originally from the Netherlands, uh, born and raised. Came to Colorado for a couple of years, fell in love. Still here, that was 20 years ago. 2010, uh, came across Team Snap as an angel investor together with a good friend and business partner and uh, decided to invest. And uh, that's how we got to know Team Snap. And uh, a year and a half ago, decided it was time to join the ranks full time. And uh, that's how long I've been here as a vice president of engineering, running the engineering team on a day to day basis. And uh, it's been a lot of fun. We hire smart people. Um, sometimes I'm always looking for that diamond in the rough. But uh, if I'm hiring a junior developer, you know, they don't have all that experience and those skills and knowledge yet. But I'm always looking for that raw horsepower. Uh, just a just a great feeling for the product, where it needs to go, uh, what kind of people to attract to make this happen, and really can, in the end, execute on that vision and really get it done. What kind of people we think we are and what we, you know, the kind of people we like interacting with as part of the team. Um, it's not just in the engineering team, it's all over. The, the kind of people that we look for and, and things like that. When we interview people, the first thing we look for is cultural fit. Uh, and what does that mean, that culture? Like I mentioned before, it's, it's empathy, it's openness, smart, are you, do you have raw mental horsepower? Um, not necessarily do you have all the skills and the knowledge. I mean, that can be built up. If that cultural fit isn't there, then typically we will shy away from going any further. It, it comes back to, to those, those, those uh, personality traits that we look for, you know, smart, uh, open, honest, uh, mentoring others, um, and a good work-life balance. We, you know, a lot of people here have families, and uh, we like to interact with each other on things that are not work-related as well. As the company grows, it also evolves. So to apply what we have today and go back to 2010 or 11 and try to apply that then probably wouldn't work. So it's basically staying on top of the changes and making sure that you evolve with the growth of the company and protect those values, protect those, those core values that we have as a company as we grow, which is what we're doing today. Everybody's a participant in that. Um, it's not just top down or anything like that. Uh, that the engineering community itself are, are very actively participating to that culture, making sure that people are engaged, people feel like they're being supported, uh, and things like that. And if you are looking for a, a company where you can uh, feel like you, you, you can grow, uh, you can uh, really uh, show your passion for, for what you do, and in our case, that's usually software development, um, and if you have uh, the ability to mentor others and have a thirst for knowledge and, uh, and are a self-starter, self-driven, etc., cetera, um, then absolutely, I want to talk to you. It's hard to find people like that, but uh, you know, when you have a good story to tell like ours, um, it's a little easier.